Hey, what's up everyone? It's the Pepper Ranger, and this is the Ahi Guyana. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Hey, what's up everyone? It's the Pepper Ranger. All right, so um, if you've been following along with me since like 2020, pretty much when I uh, started my channel, the Ahi Guyana has been one of my favorite varieties um, for, I mean, it's been like four seasons now I've grown it. And this year I've had my biggest pods ever. I think some of them have reached uh, almost a foot in length, um, a lot of 10 inches, 11 inches. This one is probably like eight or nine. Um, but they're super prolific and they've just been awesome for me this year. Uh, my first year ever growing them, I topped them like 10 times indoors because I started them super early and they grew really tall. Uh, since then I don't top anymore, but they still produce like crazy and I'm going to get a ton of unripe pods on the plant just because there are so many. Um, but yeah, it is a capsicum bicotum from, uh, Guyana and it is just an amazing pepper. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, cut it up and give it a try. All right, so I have a pretty sizable portion here and I took the seeds out because it's pretty much uh, placenta all the way down, seeds all the way down, so you can just easily flick the seeds off. But yeah, I'm gonna give it a go and I'm super excited to try it again because this is one of my favorite peppers of all time. Cheers. It is so good. So good. It has almost like a <clears throat> tangerine citrus sweet taste to it. Um, super unique flavor in my opinion. Definitely different from uh, any sort of sugar rush peach or sugar rush peach variant. Somewhat of a similar um, bacatum flavor. But man, it is crunchy, juicy. These walls are fairly thick and it's, it's incredible. I've made sauces with these. Um, right now I'm just doing a bunch of powder and the powder is coming out to be this amazing color that is pretty much st staying true to uh, type with the Guyana being the same color as it. Uh, the heat is fairly manageable at about um, I don't know, I'd probably say 15-ish Scoville heat units. It has, a, you know, that familiar burn of a bicotum where it's there, but it's just, it's just kind of hanging out. It doesn't really get much higher than when you initially start feeling that burn, but it sticks around and it's a pleasant burn. Right now it's pretty much all on the tongue, uh, but I'm gonna have another bite because mm. I piped it up a lot <coughs> and each time I'm about to try it I'm like you know what maybe it's not as good as I remember. Or when I send pods to people I'm like, eh, maybe they're not going to like it as much as me. Nope. Everyone I've had try it, loves it, and with it being so prolific and tasty, I think everyone should grow it. <laughs> Eating more now, the heat is picking up. <clears throat> it's great in, like, fresh salsas, but that flavor is just... It has a, is a very nice sweetness to it, a unique citrusy, like I said, like tangerine type flavor. I don't know if that's 100% accurate, but 
that's what I'm thinking of. At least that first bite is what that's what came to mind. But man, I mean, these pods alone <clears throat> should make you want to grow them. They're just really cool. Okay, that is going to do it for today. That was the Ahi Guyana, a capsicum bacidum from Guyana. I'm the Pepper Ranger. Have a nice day. Bye.